Old El Paso. No, not, not, no. Mucho fun tonight. Thank you. A little bit of advertising, the catch lines and phrases in the background. Uh, most uh, recent trip to California inspired me on the taco. Uh, roadside, street side, food truck tacos. Really simple. We just grilled off these beautiful little three and a half inch tacos. Just uh, taco shells. We're going to place them down. Oh, who was it? Special guest, John. John. John Borg's here, all the way from uh, Surf City, California. John, how's the, the, the tides today? No, they're uh, <laughs> yeah, kind of hot. Very good. Okay, so we're going to lay down our tacos, taco shells. John, have you ever had uh, California tacos? You, you, you mentioned earlier that you've never been to California. Yeah, I haven't, even though I love this. Okay, well, fantastic. So we're going to lay down our taco shells right here. We're going to take good old store-bought slaw. You know what, what, what the short form for slaw is? What? Whole slaw. I'm gonna drop some slaw right on each of these little tacos. And then we're gonna just, just mass that. Production. Just mass production, I don't think so. And we're gonna put those little <laughs> store bought slaw down. John, you, you, you like coleslaw? Pardon? You like coleslaw? It's amazing. And a little bit of sesame dressing, just ah. a little bit of moisture and a bit of zip and sweetness. Drop it on, drop it on, drop it on. Real simple. This is where the magic happens. This is a five hour slow roasted pork. There's a pork loin done with beautiful barbecue sauce and smoked paprika and onions. And we're gonna lay a little morsel, a little bite-sized morsel on all these. John, you like pork? Yeah. Pork comes from what kind of animal? The pig. The pig, not the cow. The pig. John's an avid fisherman. And he, you can actually have this with beautiful uh, pickerel. John, John, you love catching pickerel or bass. You go lay it nicely and you batter it up. This, this would be an awesome Lake Ontario fish taco. We'll try it one day. So then we've got the pulled pork on, and then to add a bit of crispness, we'll put on some beautiful crunchy apple. Crunchy apple goes on, and that's just not only gonna give it some sweetness, but it's also gonna give it some crunch. John, you like crunch? Crunch is good. Crunch is texture. John, this can be done with pear, uh, peach, and it's sweet and tangy. Now, what really happens afterwards is this. Beautiful sprinkling of chives. Now, chives is another form of what type of vegetable, John, for $10,000 on a trip to Hamilton? What is a chive? No idea. Smell, because John, John's going to taste this. Taste the chives. Flavor is? Yeah, it's like sweet Italian, Italian, chipotle. No, it's not. It's not. Onion. Yeah. So chives is onions. So we're gonna sure. put that on. Oh, you can catch that right now. And the last thing to it bring brings some real Mexican and California flavor is fresh cilantro. Fresh cilantro. Fresh cilantro on those beautiful little pulled pork tacos. And the last thing, just again to balance it off with some acid, we're gonna go in the fridge in real time. And John, what is this? This lime. Lime. I want to grab that lime, and this is how we're going to finish it off. We're going to take that lime, and the raindrops keep falling on my head. Beautiful citrus lime on that, and we are done. John, we've uh, we're we're in California, and we're going to have pulled pork taco done on beautiful soft shell taco shells with crispy cilantro, apple, and coleslaw. Enjoy. And ready? We're ready. Old El Paso. Mucho fun tonight. Hey. Beautiful.